position to end the Chosen Thread once and for all. Though I doubt it'll be easy. Advent isn't known for its forgiving nature, and we're setting out to destroy the last of the Elder's favorite pets today. Expect heavy resistance and stay focused. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. Greetings, hello, welcome back to more lore of the final Chosen, the Chosen Warlock. It's hopefully going to meet its end today. So, one more time, we're heading into Not a Chosen Stronghold. One of these facilities, so we have to assume the Chosen know we're here. That didn't stop us before, and it won't stop us today. You know what to do. Locking on to the Chosen's energy signature. Uploading the coordinates now. Understood. Move out. Such bravery. Such steadfast determination. Such arrogance. To step foot in this sacred temple and dare strike down a child of the gods. Your hubris is your downfall. Well, you, you know the rules and so do I. Humans, boldly pushing forth into the unknown. If you only knew the truth... What a cursed room. Okay. You would scurry back to the shadows where you were spawned. Can you stop talking for one second, please? Yeah, I can barely hear my own thoughts. Um, how are we gonna approach this this time? Which side do we want to get flanked from? Uh, this looks like it's open. There it is. Damn! How we knew there'd be resistance today. You know what to do. Chill, Bradford. Chill. So you require my aid. How expected. Good. Just, I'm just gonna be a little bit more aggressive here today, I think. Get you go. Especially since we have a Sentinel now, so we get two overwatch shots on him. Um. Ten four. So they walk into the line of sight and they get shot a bunch. Maybe. It hit the plate. A waste of time and energy. Some good damage out there. I just don't come any closer here. I got I got a stuff to it. Wheels will permeate all around us. Can you not feel it, humans? Their reach is eternal. Even now their hand closes upon you. Now I did pick up traverse fire, so I can actually take two shots now if I want to. Would have, of course, preferred to take in two shots that actually hit something. Hang on. I do have three reconceals. Should we just do a blinding fire here and clear the overwatch that way? Just hoping I can get all three of them, but that's not happening, I think. Hmm. Shock Troopers a lot of health, Lances a lot of health. Part of me just really wants to Burial Blade to get a repositioning in with Captain, but that's mm, tricky. You know, yeah, we have free stuff protocols. Let's just use a Blinding Fire here. Uh, what's my damage on the Burial Blade? 15, 16 on that guy. Got 
something here. What did you I've expect? got the loot here. Okay, if we can't hit 274s, then we should probably just go back home. Um, I think the safe play in this case is then that you kill the sky and jet. Ooh. Need some mobility, or we need. To, yeah, let's just run and gun. We'll just run and gun here, and we stun gun the Andromeda on this turn. I also can't deal with the phase two thing. Okay. So run and gun with you. Kill this. Yeah, sure. Let's do it this way. And then Jet can rapid fire the, the shell, and that should be it. The others were just never that good. For you are the true abominations. Microbes that think themselves greater than the gods. You taint this place with your infestation. All right. What exactly do you plan on doing with that thing anyway? Roger that. I hope you're right. Ah. That kind of also dictates the way we move through the facility here. Instead of here going through the middle and then being flanked from two sides, we're just going to go in on this side here. Take one stealth protocol, please. Got it covered. Just let me know. There's something out there. Well, this seems to be like this cell block corridor thing. Might have a turret inside. Salt perch bishop, huh? But I think oh God, this is really gonna be a good idea. Been disappointed by kill zone. Hi. Run and gun back, yes. So we can, with dedication, get in there, kill the vanguard. Um, Purge boy is easily stunnable. Prior priest needs a little bit help, and we don't know what's around the corner. Whether or not we have anybody upstairs. Like there's sometimes a turret up here. Themes, okay. Alright, 
so. Not a problem. That's obviously not fantastic. That's actually really bad. Now I do have plenty of rockets here. That is certain I don't need all of them for next turn. If there's any way I can get a good trench gun on all of those guys. Maybe like from here. That's never gonna kill. I'm not sure if it's gonna do 26 damage. The thing is, we're doing, we're doing the thing where a simple table blocks the rocket, okay. Do I need both shreds on rockets for the warlock? That's the question here. Nah. Nah, we'll be fine. Chance to it will not be great against the, the, the Perch Bishop, and I'm fairly certain that that spot is probably not in line of sight for a command. That could work, but then I'm also really far away from the Vanguard. The tiles. Three tiles straight and three tiles diagonal. Let me actually. Can I even hit that? No. You can't hit the direct diagonal if you want to hit straight ahead of you. Easy peasy. I'm just gonna kill the cryo priest now. Thirty-seven percent. What? Oh, he has full cover from this direction. I'm not sure, like, Killzone should not trigger on him a second time, right? That's that's not how it works. There's one to four damage, that's not gonna be enough. <clears throat> Let me see, you are immune to what? Immune to radiation damage, immune to fire, colds. Get her scary.
Now, I wish I could check Lana's side if uh, Crumpet can basically teamwork Jet as in the way, right? This, this first pillar is going to be in the way. Okay, so I could command here, then teamwork, then, then Jet just takes care of it. Um. <laughs> Could do is suppress the guy and rescue protocol jet out of there. I mean, we're sitting a little bit here with our butt flapping in the wind. That worked. 54. Yeah, all right, all right. suppression. Reliable as ever. Alright, we've got two guys over here, and then whatever is here in the towards the final room. I think we're gonna take a turn here for some reloads. Repositioning and re something else. I'm not super feeling comfortable going in here when we have at least two guys over on this side still. Oh, not again. Especially when one of those guys is a freaking exalted custodian. Absolutely. Sure. Running gun up again next turn. Going for the long flank. Man, just rush in here. But he might have loot. No, let's let's head right over here then. That door at the back there is also already oh, still closed, rather. No need to ask twice. Make haste. My blade thirst. I may have to pick up the pace. Already there. Come get some. How much longer must I endure your sacrilege? If it is peace you want, I shall gladly oblige. Come forward, XCOM, and yield to my embrace. I shall grant you merciful slumber. Don't need to grant me slumber, you just need to shut Go the hell up. Oh, holy crap. Um. I'll be there 
before you know it. Heading out. All right. Do you hear that? I think that's the group we, we had before, because no, that's the other group. Oh, please tell me they were not on alert. And don't get yellow alert chrysalid attacks, because that's that's something that exists. That's as bullshit as it sounds. And still you defy us. We who have held this world together for years. Would that the elders did not need your race. I would have ended its existence long ago. That's right. Transport yep. portal yep. directly ahead. Updating coordinates now. Got it. Let's go. Updating coordinates. Just just move to the thing over there. That's the coordinate all the coordinates we need here. Um but we need a little bit more movement. Why do do just zip that guy? Yeah, sure. Oh I'm a rifle hunter. Okay. Hmm. Went off the armor. We'll get back to you. There. Here. By the right of Rexier, I am High Lord. I think we're just going for the good old. Ever vigilant Overwatch here. Yeah? It just confuses me that it's not showing up here, but I know you have Ever vigilant. Leaving two enemies behind, don't care. Don't think we need to uh, artificially wait for any cooldowns here. Yeah? Yes, 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 yes. You've I got everything ready. You've got, well, a trench gun, but don't need that. Or a blade on one. Reloading! Reloading. Okay. Let's, let's go. Take a quick sip of water to get ready for the final room. And brace yourself for a long war without the chosen um, introductions in the next few episodes. But maybe let's kill him first, though. Get ready, people. You know what's coming next. Very good, little humans. Come to me. Like a moth to a flame will you be consumed by my brilliance. Ah, oh, yes, his brilliance. How could I forget? Um, a right. bunch of frost bombers. I think that was also 
third frost bomb over here. Now, interestingly, um, because of the way XCOM works, it gave me another copy of each of my rockets because of um, iron rations. Well, a third Saren and a second Shredstorm rocket again. If I move backwards, I trigger them already. Ah, this is this is some cursed situation here. So maybe, maybe we'll just set them all on fire. Maybe not. Ah, that positioning sucks. Storm, not Red Storm, Siren. Can I get Siren like here somewhere? Oh no, there's, there's low cover walls. All right, I think we're playing a little bit of a dangerous game, but we're playing a game here. Uh, we're playing the game of just set up the kills on where you stand. Plan. The weak always fall. And then you can... Move smile aside to everybody. that I can't even take a step back. It seems so wild to me. It's like I'm spotted here, 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 here. Like, how is he not spotting me where I'm currently standing? Absolutely. What the hell? I'm just gonna move and kill the... Yeah, let's just kill the Necro. I've got something here. That's how no, it's... my loot. Such is the way of the town that no prisoners. You waited for a trench gun, eh? Should have waited for the trench gun. Seems terrible. Alright, uh, you know the drill. Um, let's count tiles. Ten. Seventeen is like the, the final row of this. Um, okay. Means we can't pick up those loots unless we engage within the next three turns. I don't need the kill zone. I kind of need to wait for dedication. Maybe. There it is. It 
So, um, the usual stuff, I think. We're gonna trigger with knockout from the right side. Trigger from the right side, try to lure the, the warlock to the left, and we have our people on the left. Hopefully taking good shots then. Yeah, I think I get that loot. I shouldn't even bother trying. Will do. Yeah, and Jet comes over here, and I'm fairly certain I can sneak up all the way to that wall. Which I think then you also do. Then we just come up here to activate, giving us another side to this. And she can run and gun to get a full, well placed Redstone rocket on the on the wall. Solid copy. So. Then it's just a matter of moving into position for unload. Uh, getting whatever it is. Fuchs fire on him. Alright. Just try it. That's the theory. Let's see if we can actually make it happen. I'm on it. One suppressor, two Illyrium cores. Oof. Let's get this show on the road. Oh yeah. Yeah, you're in position, you're in position. You're in position Don't dedication yes. next turn. I shall win your battle shortly. Do I like where you can move with a blue move? No, actually. Heading out. Let's get you like here. Alright, do this. If only you knew the truth, the power in my hands, you would fall to your knees before me. Pity. I suppose we should begin then. Menace, you know what to do. It's do or die time. At last, the humans speak the truth. Well, that's actually not what I wanted you to do, my friend. That is absolutely not what I want him to do. What an awful, awful first move. Okay. Set him up, knock him down. Let's just see if we can destroy his cover and force him to move somewhere else. Well, what I like more. Firing rocket. Are you gonna actually shoot here? No, for a second, I thought he would um, attack me here for. All right. I can I can get an unload on you. How much damage are we looking at? We're doing we have eight shots at nine to eleven. So let's say ten. <laughs> Um, that's roughly 80 damage. Um, that's not gonna be enough. But it's unpercent, so there's no reason actually to use, um, 
whatever it's called. Focus fire. Yeah, just let him have it. Piss poor job at that. He shot back at me, right? He has returned fire or something. Um, ah, right, 29 damage. So, time for, time for Captain to come up here. Not a problem. Yeah, you can do 29. You just gotta hit him. I guess for this we could have used the focus fire. Then we would have found percent without any grace chance. This device functions in a similar fashion to the capacitor. What the HP? Previously. I recommend haste in disabling its prime mechanism to prevent the chosen from regenerating indefinitely. Yes, Doctor. Let's blow it to hell. Exactly what he said, Bradford. At least someone is paying attention. Now, I'm kind of regret that I uh, used dedication, even though I don't need it this turn, and then I won't have it for sure. the warlock reappearing. Look at that, actually hitting both shots. With the capacitor damaged, the regeneration process has been interrupted. I believe now would be the appropriate time to take them out. Then you know what to do. Take that creature down. So he might spawn in anywhere, right? He could spawn in behind me. Oh, he's very likely actually. Yeah, he's spawning in on one of the platforms. So I'm considering we're gonna pop a rescue Don't worry. I have an idea. on both of them to get them into better positions here. Watch yourself. Better position here actually just means go to this corner. Right yeah, can be hunting from there. That's fine. We get over here. So he should be on thir uh, one third of self, so what? 42? Yeah, okay. Elders, they are silent. Uh, I always wanted to be like the elders, right? I, I did have a shot here. It's not fantastic, but hey, if it shreds him fully and applies shred storm, then that works for me. He does have return fire, right? So I actually don't want to get injured by him. Let me just pop a shield. In case he survived that. Alternatively. Right. 
Which <laughs> gunfire has triggered by suppression. That never happened before, right? I could not have learned this from a previous encounter. You dare strike the Elder's Chosen! Yeah, wanna see me do it again? It's a really dumb position there, by the way, buddy. Pop. I told you I was the best. What unnecessary suppression, unnecessary wound. It wasn't easy, but we managed to pull it off, Commander. If only we could see the look on the elders' faces. Rechosen, free botched science experiments. No, hang on, that was the other guys. Uh, anyway, we got him. I feel like there should be an Easter egg where you see like this um, stony fight a warlock. I don't know, as, as a book stand in Bradford's office or something like that. Speaker commended loyal citizens today for standing up to those who would abandon our values for those of the old world. The remarks followed a moment of silence for peacekeepers slain by XCOM dissidents. At least we know for sure now that the Chosen can be taken out permanently. I was starting to worry we might never hear the last of them. Understandable worry. Um, I see a little, little spurly circles here. So we do have two people with more psionic power here that were on the squad. That's why we didn't see them in the drop down before. All right, oh, whopping 40 alloys and crystals. That's going to be nice. Some cores, some cores we missed. And some corpses. Basic mutant corpses. Ooh. Feel like the advanced frost bombers should probably be um, mutant elite corpses. That feels kind of unrewarding getting regular mutant corpses that late. Anyway, um, I want those two here to actually finally get level two bond. So let's get in there. Then there was one thing I forgot to do. Um, so I think I mentioned it before, but there's currently a little a little bug, a little issue with the proficiency classes. Wait, I'm not sure why why my like you're not a proficiency class. You shouldn't have weird little little icons there. Um, so proficiency classes in the current version of the mod are supposed to get soldier AP, but they don't. So what we're going to do is manually give them Soldier AP. That doesn't actually exist, a way to do that. So the only thing I can do is give XCOM AP and then just spend that. Um, so at low combat intelligence, you should have 35, which we can't actually, we can't spend 35, right? We can only spend um, 30 or five extra spent for, uh, 40. 
So let's just think about what you should actually get. Um, that's a good question. What should you not get? There's no point you having Sentinel or Stiletto or light him up. Very little reason to give concentration. That could be an argument made to me to get flush. Uh, I mean, running gun would be great, but then I would be spending XCOM AP. And it's very rarely that you need to run and gun in order to throw a grenade where you want it, especially once we use beam grenade launches. So I think we're just gonna pick up Unbreakable and forget about the rest. Unbreakable and flush. So what I'm gonna do, even though I should be getting 35, um, I'm just gonna give me a 40. Uh, give resource. Ability point, 30. I need to kind of, yeah, well, we have 45 XCOM AP, and then we get these two. And that's your official XCOM AP here. Uh, I don't think any of our, our other proficiency classes reached Master Sergeant yet. No, Field Medic is a Tech Sergeant, and so is our Marine. And... That is Gunnery Sergeant, right? Yeah. Right, so we do that once they reach max rank. Um, we also have covert action pending. What's happening on the G-Scape? A smash and grab. You've got a recover item, and that was for flight paths. Yeah, cool. Got another recover item down here, and we've got what is this one? Extra scientist, if we want it, or rather, an extra mission, if we want it. I think I'm gonna s not do this. And just have people ready for the for the UFO here. So that means we can just also get any covert action going. Alright, so skirmisher covert actions are not also free of any any nastiness. Any of his sweet tendernesses. Um Oh, look, and 257 intel, but we probably need at least one 200 contact. So maybe maybe grab some extra intel here, guys. My kind will do whatever is needed. Seems good. Scout rifle. Permanent tax sense with a two day timer. I guess we're not um, stopping that or oh, missing out on a tech sergeant akimbo. What a shame. Okay, and just like that, we are at 100% over here. Now, this is a slightly underleveled squad, so I'm kind of wondering if that's something I want to over infiltrate a little bit with it 7 to 9, just to, you know, just playing it safe. Yeah, let's, let's over infiltrate that a little bit. Yeah, okay, it's vulnerable now, so we can run this. We also have 100% here on the recover item. Um, very certain this is a f much stronger squad with a bunch of Master Sergeants. So yeah, we've got this, we've got that, and then we've got a smash and grab here. The next three missions, the next three episodes, all lined up nicely. So we're gonna 
probably do this recovery in the next episode. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.